Hello there and welcome to the new video and in this video I am taking a comment from my uh, viewer or maybe a subscriber that uh, can someone without technical background or IT become a data analyst I think that's what it means or can come into the field into the data analytics now this question has come on my video which is what does a data analyst do just to make a beginner or someone who wants to come into this field just to make them aware about this and this is a very genuine and a very normal question because whatever videos that you see even on my channel or on someone else we have posted a lot of videos on the data analysis by using the tools I mean today because the data is becoming huge day by day you cannot really escape from the tools I mean whatever work that you do mostly is on the tool it can be as simple tool as Microsoft Excel or it can be as complex as a Python programming right but the whole thing is if you don't have the background can you come into this this data analytics overall what I feel based on my experience the answer is yes reason for this is that when I became first data analyst back in uh, 2008 then when I when I joined this organization I did not have a super experience about the uh, about the technical tools or the programming language but what I did have is basically a good understanding of mathematics statistics and economics as well as what I did at that time is I complemented my skills with my two months of uh, of the program which I learned it was in the SAS at that time statistical analysis system is what I learned at that time but that was just so that I can basically use any tool I already knew by that time Microsoft Excel because that's a very common one which I had uh, where when I started my computer learning that's what I did basically and that's what usually everyone does they learn the Microsoft Office but to slightly upgrade myself I basically learned about this SAS. Now SAS is nothing a programming or anything. It is basically a tool in which you write some two or three commands and you get the results out. So it has done all the programming in the back end and you just write the proc and data commands and you basically uh, get the results out. So the whole thing is that if you are planning to come into the data analytics, the previous IT background is not required. However, the knowledge of the tool any tool of your choice I mean I started with SAS but SAS what I feel is these days mostly used by uh, mostly used by banks or pharmaceutical companies and all uh, I have, I'm not seeing it uh, that's just my you know impression that I'm not seeing it used in many different organization that I'm working uh, from past uh, seven or eight years they are using some new age tools which is uh, Tableau or ClickSense or Power BI and things like those but the whole thing is that uh, you cannot escape from the IT or from the technical thing when you are uh, working in the data analysis field why because the organization or a data analyst within the organization if I say 70% of the time deal with the data analysis problem where they need to create a report dashboard or the presentation the 70 the 30 percent of the time is still going into how to manage it on a ongoing basis or if it is becoming large uh, month by month or quarter by quarter by having more and more data you basically try to automate this let's say by using the macros or by using any dashboarding tool tableau power bi or ClickSense, and try to simplify your life and that's when you basically get excited and generally what i've seen uh, is those even who don't have the experience they are really excited those analysts are really excited to learn about macros to learn about these tools including me that's what I did back in the day in 2008 when I joined when I had this my first uh, organize my second organization uh, where I was working as a data analyst as a full time I basically learned Excelsius tool back in uh, 2008 because that was the tool company was using at that time it took me almost a month time to really go through the entire book and I learned it in and out and I delivered many dashboards so so you cannot escape it uh, all in all from the IT or from the technical tools but to come into the data analysis field uh, you know this is not a mandatory requirement that I would say 
This is a complement skill. This is a skill along with your data analysis if you can acquire like I did with, with a two month course, you can acquire very easily. It is, it is similar to learning any program, any language or any habit that you are doing. I mean, uh, we, have, we have these other things that we learn like for example, learning the music or learning uh, a, let's say any other art related classes. Similarly, you basically learn it over a month or two month period of time and, and get yourself uh, familiarized with what is, the, in, what is the IT thing that you need to know to, to become a successful data analyst. So short answer, yes, you, uh, you can come into the data analytics background. You can learn and join the data analytics as a domain uh, without the IT background, but you cannot escape from it. You will have to learn one or the other tool to basically complement your data analysis skills so that at the end of the day, you are fast, you are more, uh, your skills are more scalable and you are able to do more in less time. So that's what I wanted to share my perspectives as to what I think about this particular question. Let me know if you still have any question, any doubt about this, or you have your own experience which you want to share um, uh, about, about this particular topic. I think that will be great to learn even from you as to uh, what do you really think about this piece. So with that, thank you so much for watching and I'll meet in the next video, maybe with uh, some new topic or maybe with some new question. So thank you, bye.